Hello everyone and welcome to a new series! So I decided it's about time that I actually played the Lennon games. Now, what what is what is Lennon, you might ask? Um Well, Lennon is kind of like a series that's inspired by Toho. It's made by this guy named Jinx. He used to make all these like Peace 98 remix remake videos on April Fools and he actually made his own games and um, so it's not like a Toho fan game it's its own series but it's got like Toho elements to it um, this is the very first game I Evanescent Existence I guess that's how you pronounce it and yeah so um, there's no lunatic mode instead it's unreal mode and of course we're gonna be playing that and we got two characters, but the second one is not even unlocked, so we couldn't even play them if we wanted to. So we're going to have to play with this character, and I don't even know her name. So I'm probably not even going to win. Probably not even going to get past, like, stage three, but we'll try. So, yeah, I don't know anything about the mechanics. At all. I don't know what I'm doing. At all. I really don't. But that's part of the fun, is it not? I wonder if Grace does anything. This stage seems really straightforward. We have bombs and deaths and things like that. Ah, good death bombing. And looks like my character is homing. That's always nice. Okay, I already had the bomb there. Now, one thing about the Linen games is that their graphics are always very, like, foggy. Or, I don't know how to pronounce it. There's this very unique design in the graphics of the Linen games, where the graphics are all, like, foggy and hazy, and it's kind of nice. The art style kind of looks a bit zoonish, too, but not really whole. Hey, can I reset? I did not know that was. I did not know that option exited the game, so we're gonna have to go back and do this again. Um, I guess, is this reset? Okay, so it's the second option, not the last option. Uh, but I know that the beginning starts off with streaming. <laughs> so, we will just stream this. Oh, but we're not gonna get items if we do that, so... Uh -uh. Alright, well if there's enemies from the left that are insistent on spawning needle bullets, then I'll just start to the left and straight to the right. Simple solution, huh? Yeah. And I'm guessing it's gonna mirror, or the stage is gonna mirror, and I'm going to be able to do the same from the right. Finding it pretty difficult to POC though. Yeah, I'm finding it hard to find points to actually POC. I might have to just like never POC ever. But let's reset. We wasted two bombs. You don't want to waste two bombs at the beginning. Okay, so I guess we're just not going to POC because you'll just, you can't POC. Yeah, there's no way to kill all of these and there's really no feasible way to... Press up. Ugh. Okay, you know what? Since I can't kill anything, I'm just gonna go to the bottom left, and I'm just gonna slowly stream and do nothing else. Since evidently that's all I can do. And I'm gonna miss all the items, and I'm not gonna POC. Or I can wait till now. I'm gonna go to the right side of the screen, and I'm just gonna do the same exact thing. I'm not going to kill everything, I'm going to miss all the items, but apparently that's all I can do. <laughs> I can tell I'm going to have trouble. I heard that Linen is very meme-tastic, or at least the first game is, so yeah, that'll be something. I'd imagine a lot of this is learnable though, so I mean, yeah, there is that. 
Also, Linen really likes to mess with, like, colors from what I can see and what I've heard. Like, there's gonna be a lot of, like, black and white bullet patterns, and, like, the black bullets are gonna blend in with the background, and say, so will the white bullets. And there's a lot of weird gimmicky things with Linen. Alright, so it looks like I can do a lot better when I have more... And good thing I didn't PSC, because I learned that PSCing in this game is not a good idea ever. I kind of have to POC now. Oh, no. Alright, so... Pro tip linen number one, everything is streaming. Pro tip of linen number two, never POC. I wonder if I need to POC, though, to get my lives, because I don't know how to get extends in this game. I'm guessing their score, but I don't know. Kudo Hebi! Um, Black Snake? Is that what her name means? Heavy means snake, but I, d I don't know what kudo means. I think it means black, but I don't know. This game has really generous death bomb timers, though. Way more generous than Toho. Like, if that was Toho, I would have died instantly. Also, on Linen, you can actually go to the bottom of the screen. Yeah. You can go to the bottom. You don't. Y your hitbox doesn't stop here. I guess we're just gonna have to try to see how far we can get. Um. Ah! That was scary. Um, this reminds me of that one pattern from SSS, that one timeout spell from stage 4 with Raymu. Sukun? What? Oh. I see. Those things don't actually hurt you. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> I'm glad I had a homing. I bet I'm gonna get an extend at 10 million, right? And this, yes. That's what my intuition told me. Hey, look, it's an ocean. I bet this is gonna be aimed at me. I bet this is gonna be aimed at me, yep. I was born yesterday, not. And this is also going to be aimed, and I didn't get away in time, damn it. See, I didn't know when it was actually going to shoot, so I didn't know when to actually move. It looks like every single stage portion and every single thing in this game is just streaming, so we're just going to stream literally everything because that's how you win. So, yep. It's gonna fire aimed things. It's gonna fire more aimed things. It's gonna fire more aimed things. Everything's aimed. I'm not insulting this game for that, by the way. Oh, it's gonna turn into a boss. She's gonna... Do some really weird things I... Could not have known. Alright, but now that I know what she's gonna do, I can adequately prepare myself. It looks like as long as you move a bunch, you don't have to worry. Go ahead and get a bump! What? Oh, that death bomb didn't work. Oh, man. I wonder if I can micro stream this. I don't want to risk it. I can get away from that. Power. Alright, we're gonna game over. Totally. Well, I just wanted to make it past stage 3, but... I'm guessing nothing happens if I press C, because I know that's a thing in the other games, but I know there's no, like, flash bomb in this particular game. Or maybe there is one, and I just don't know about it. Really? Okay. Power. Ah, I got a full power clear. Uh, oh no.
I don't think no bombing this mode is possible. Because I, I wanted to try in the future, but I don't know yet how to dodge anything. Okay, if she doesn't die, I'm dead. Okay, good. She died. Just gotta dodge. I've done dodging before. Okay. What are you gonna do next? Oh, okay. Wait. Is this thing gonna. S Wait. Is this thing gonna stop? What? Wait. Does that thing not stop? How are you supposed to change lanes? What? What? That thing doesn't actually stop. But, aren't you supposed to change lanes? What if I play the other character that doesn't have homing? Am I just screwed? What? Also, am I bombing? Is, did that aim at me? Or did it aim ahead of me? Or did it aim while I was moving? I can't tell anymore. Oh. Jinx. Nah, I'm sure these patterns all have tricks to them though. They all got patterns. Like I'm sure like all of this is learnable. Once you get used to it. What's next? What are you gonna do? It's a simple case of misdirection and not bottom hugging. Also, is it me or does this boss have a lot of attacks for a stage 2 boss? I already know that this is the stage where you have to fight the other character, the other player character. I had to bomb during simple streaming. Oh no. My pride is a linen player. <laughs> I just called myself a linen player. How do you actually score in this game? Do you just bomb and get score from that? I'm guessing it has to do with your thrill, which apparently you die while trying to increase. I'm just trying to graze. Let me graze. Why won't you let me graze? Is it possible for those lasers to hit you? Like... Are those aimed- I'm assuming those are aimed around you. And I'm assuming that it's impossible for it to actually hit you directly in front. Because, I, I might be wrong about this, but it, it, it seems like those bullets might be a little bit too fast. And that it might not be humanly possible to react if one of them just happens to go in your direction. So I'm going to assume that these are all aimed around you. Because I've yet to see one actually go inside my path. If I get hit, by any of these, then I'm going to turn off this game and never play it again. If I get hit by any of those lasers, then I'm never playing this game again. Okay, good. It looks like they don't actually aim at you. They're just for decoration. That That's fine. That's absolutely fine. 
I've, I would have had a problem if it were possible for those lasers to hit you, because there's no way that you could possibly react to that, but no, no, it, it's fine. Oh, this looks cool. Look at that background. So what does Thrill do? Does it increase your PIV? Does this game even have PIV? Does anyone score Lennon? Are there any like score super players of this game? I doubt it, but... Nah, I'm sure there's some people that score this game. Probably not on Unreal mode though. Alright. And Raku Subakura. The other main character. I don't think I'm gonna be able to dodge this pattern. Probably gonna die. It's too crazy. Alright, what do you have for me? Oh, that looks cool. And it's aimed, so it's lovely streaming. Well, then we shall restream, because that's what you do with aim tap turns, is you bomb right before you get hit so you don't actually die. Not that it matters, because I game over, so the run's basically null. But I just want to see what's going on in this game before I actually do anything. And I like this pattern. Wow. That looked cool. Oh, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, 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 spirals, spirals, spirals. Uh, good thing I'm playing as a homing shot. Um, I'm assuming this pattern is made in consideration that you're only going to fight it with... I think her name is Yabusame. Um, and she has homing. So you, it's okay for a pattern like this to exist only for a homing shot because of the fact that... Yeah, that I like those kinds of game designs that take into consideration what shot you're playing and cater a spell card towards them. All right. Uh, 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 oh, interesting. But I don't understand the gimmick yet. But I also assume that it's just some streaming. Can these actually reach the bottom? Because I don't think they can. No, these can't reach the bottom of the screen. That That's an intimidation attack. It's not even hard. It's streaming. I'm sure you could tell just by looking at it. I'm gonna cap this. I will capture this. Absolutely. I have faith in myself. I know I can do it. Yay! Get spell card bonus. I haven't seen that in a long time. <sighs> what? You can get a lot of thrill on this attack. Holy shit. Hold on. I want to see how much thrill I get from each wave of that. Ah! What? Understand. I wonder if you can die while attacks are ending. Alright. There's pictures being shown in my face. Rocks. This looks easy. I bet you 30 mil gets me a life. I bet you 30 mil gets me a life. Wait, why can't I hit... Th oh, I accidentally got into a safe spot. Nice! I accidentally got into a good safe spot.
I'm assuming I want to kill these before they do anything. But I'm also assuming I want to get some thrill if I can. Man, it's impossible for me to get this 30 mil life that I knew I'd get. But I got it. Wow, this stage is really nice. Ah! I wanted to be a C and didn't see those. I didn't see those. I'm guessing the bigger the point item, the more you're going to get from it. Yeah, I'm assuming so. I'm assuming this is also a breather stage, kind of like a lulled case stage 4. <laughs> probably. Hey, it's probably Callum's avatar. <laughs> yeah, this is probably Callum's avatar that he used for like 10 million years before changing it. I'm just gonna call this character Callum. I think this is the same character. I don't know. Okay, what is it gonna do? It's gonna aim at me, isn't it? All those bubbles are gonna turn into aim bullets. Actually, no, they're not. Wow. Defying my expectations. And I know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna have to go up because if I stay at the bottom, I'll die from the explosion. That was very obvious. I am proud of myself for figuring that out. And I'm probably gonna have to go another wave, but of course I try to go around a white bullet and I end up dying. Wow, do these things have bomb shields? Not fast enough. What are they gonna do? I don't know, but whatever it is, I dodged it. boss time. Okay. We're gonna fight Shitodo Hoaka. Let's hope her fight's not shit. Oh. Finally, a boss who's doing something normal. Alright, can you do something normal? <laughs> ha! That wasn't normal, but that was fine. Waiting on the aimed thing. Oh, she died because I killed her. Okay. Hey, it's Shinky's thing. Ah, I got so far. But in the end, it didn't even matter. What now? What? Okay. Oh. I think I, what? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. You have to move through before they start moving. Bit too dense there, buddy. Why did I hear a sound?
what's going on next? <laughs> Creation and destruction, how edgy. Gonna game over again. But it seems like you get unlimited game overs, so that's good. Alright. What now? I get the feeling this game's Unreal mode isn't really held to the standard of. Toho's lunatic mode in the sense that Unreal mode feels like it's probably not meant to be done without resource management. Like I get the feeling that things like no bomb Unreal are probably not doable. Cause I don't think you get a lot of lives and oh no I'm getting flashbacks to that one Kogasa mid-boss spell and P-Mom, whatever you call it. This basically is that mid-boss spell, except a little bit different. I didn't know. I thought it was going to go left and right. And I ran out of rare game overs! Uh, I guess that means that's it for this video. Maybe I'll win next time. Alright, well, see you guys next time.